Hi, in this video, I want to show you how to create a pretty cool transition using some shapes and some animations, just like that. So as you can see, we've got this really nice looking animation. This will look, look really good with explainer videos um, and basically any kind of video you like with this really nice looking shape transition. So what we're going to do is basically delete all these uh, shapes and again, just go to the shape tool over here. And what you're going to do is type in button and uh, simply select this shape here, okay? So what I'm going to do is just resize this and make it a lot bigger so that it kind of fits the top half of the screen like that. And that's looking good. And what I'm going to do to make it even simpler is to use motion presets. You can do this with uh, position custom animations, but I'm going to use motion presets. I'm going to type top right for this one. And I'm going to go to motion and select slide left okay and you have to see that we've got this animation like that um, but you can see that the shape is already on the screen so what i'm going to do is select the animation with the time indicator at the start of it and go to the settings property and just type in something like 2500 okay so or maybe a little bit more maybe 2600 okay cool so now you can see that it's starting off the screen and it's going to slide in like this. Okay, cool. So what I'm going to do is duplicate that using Command D and just bring this a little bit to the, to the right to offset it so that we have another color that comes in a little bit later. And I'm going to select the shape and make it a nice blue color. So let's just bring this up like this. Something like that. You can play around with it and you know see what looks good to you. So you can see we've got this white coming across. Maybe I'll make it a little bit earlier, so it's, so it's not too much of a delay. And it's just, let's just preview this. Okay, like that, cool. So you can make it a little bit faster. Maybe I'll just drag this out a little bit faster and I've got that's looking good. Now what I wanna do is again, add the same shape and I'm just gonna click on the button over here and I'll just zoom out and resize it. So it's basically the same kind of size as the top one and I'll position it like so. And I'm going to bring this one underneath and I'm going to call this one bottom left. Okay, cool. So that with this one, I'm just going to go make it slide in from the left. So let's just, whoops, come across and I'll just use the space bar to kind of drag across. And I'm going to position that like so and just simply go to the uh, motion presets over here and go to slide right add that and what I'm going to do is again position this off the screen so let's go to just drag this across maybe minus 2600 or something like that or 2700 or maybe 2800 looks good <laughs> okay cool so yeah we've got this looking good and that's going to come across like so and I'm going to duplicate this one and again I'll just make it offset the same kind of uh, speed or duration as this one here and I'm gonna again change that color so click on the color options and I'm gonna select this uh, eyedropper tool and simply select that color so it's the same as the top one and you'll be able to see now if I just preview this through from the start you'll be able to see a really nice transition that we just created like that cool so this is how easy it is to go through and create this nice looking transition just simply creating one our shape sliding to the left, one sliding to the right, and just basically duplicating it and changing the colors and then offsetting it a little bit so they start a little bit later like that. Like so. Cool. So have fun creating some nice transitions inside Create Studio.